Hi everybody, thanks for joining me on today's little Bite Size Thrive. I'm Kim Forrester and I am so grateful for those of you who are joining me on this little well-being journey, taking small steps every day to enhance our well-being from the inside out. This week's topic is creativity because when it comes to well-being, there are a few concepts, there are a few tools as powerful for boosting well-being as creativity is. Studies have shown that when we engage in creative pursuits and creative activities, we actually enhance our health and well-being by calming down our nervous system. And that actually decreases the risk or the symptoms of depression and anxiety. It boosts our immunity. And a study in New Zealand has shown that if we actually engage in something creative today, tomorrow, all other things considered, we should wake up feeling happier and with greater life satisfaction. So over the coming days, the first thing I really want us to consider and to work on is creating space in our life and in our homes to be creative. When we are creative, it is about being present, right? It's about being in a flow. It's about curiosity. It's about engagement. Uh, it's about play and joyfulness. That's what creativity is about. And I think the problem that many of us have in our modern lives is that very few of us have space in our time or in our homes or in our lives for that kind of gentle exploration into creative pursuit. So, if you are with me over the coming days, let's create some space in our life for creativity. How does that look? Well, it means that perhaps there's a space in your home that's a little bit cluttered at the moment. How about we go about decluttering the spaces in our home and in our lives and in our workspaces perhaps that are actually drawing us down and, and, and suppressing that sense of creativity and play. Just clear out a corner or clear out a room. Clear a space where you know you can be and your mind doesn't have to be sitting there stressing about what should be cleared out of your space or the jobs or the work that you have to do. The other thing, really important thing we can all do is create some space in our schedules for more creative play and, and pursuit. So go through maybe in the next few days and have a look at a few of the tasks or, or invitations or calendar invites uh, that really you're not that invested in and just clear a little bit of time out of your schedule and we're going to use that time later in the week to actually engage in creativity and put us first and boost our well-being by being joyfully playful curious inquisitive and creative so there you are today's little bite-sized thrive jumping into the joy of creativity i love very few things more than actually being creative. I love having you along with me on this journey. I'll see you in a few days time. In the meantime, clear some space in your home where you can be creative, clear some space in your time and your life where you can invite creativity in. I'll see you in a few days. Till then, take care. Bye.